Hey guys, this is Shan's Life and I'm back with another YouTube video. So today, y'all, uh, I'm going to be doing a getting to know me. It's an update. Um, Basically, it's going to be like a part one, part two, maybe a part three. It's going to be very kind of long. It's just basically, I'm going to be just going over my life, but in a summary. Yeah. So y'all can just get to know me a little better. Like, everybody know, <clears throat> like... I think I did a video on this channel about, I think it was 10 facts about me, or I don't, I don't remember. I think it, I think I deleted it, or asked to delete it, or something happened, so I don't know. So, for my <clears throat> new, new YouTubers, I mean, my new subscribers are my, you know, um, everybody know my name is Shanice. Everybody knows, or I'm 20 years old. I will be 21 in November. Um... I um, graduated high school. Mm, I went on to um, Long Star College because I wanted to do nursing. And, you know, um, I still want to do nursing, but I kind of stopped because it's just a lot of stuff going on right now. <clears throat> um, but I am going to complete my um, education. Um, I have a child. I have one kid. He's three. Uh, he just turned three August the 7th. Um, also, I have another child, but that child is, well, that's for another video. I'm pregnant as of right now, but that's going to be for another video. Um, <clears throat> anyway, I want to take it a little back. I was, uh, let me see. I was raised by my grandmother, me and my sister. My mother, uh, at the time, she could not take care of us. So, you know, she just gave us to my grandmother. Well, I think I was two years old when my grandmother got me. And <clears throat> my my sister, she was a newborn. And um, we, uh, you know, grandma made it work. You know, grandma is how they are. It's just... It's not rare. It is rare. Well, no, it's not because most grandmothers raised their, you know, some some grandmothers, but my grandmother did. She did a good job <coughs> raising us and stuff and getting us through school and everything. And I just want to thank her. Um, it was hard or whatever because it was other grandkids. It was not just me and my sister. It was other, like our cousins. Like it would be us spending the night or be on top of each other like grandma house was the house where everybody came to or everybody dropped their kid off you know it was just grandma and um she did a good job putting us through school and raising us like she did um she made sure we didn't want or need for nothing we had clothes on our back we had food in our mouth and um make sure we were doing good in school and our grades were up to par um uh, my father, I, I knew who my, well, it was complicated back then because I really didn't know who my dad was. It was between two people, and I really didn't care to know, honestly, because I already knew who my mother was. It really didn't bother me as much as it bothered my sister or my other. Actually, because I come from, well, I have four siblings, because it's me, you know, it's my brother, my older brother, it's me, my sister, then my, it's my I have another sister, and then it's my little brother. So, it's really, it's five of us. But we were all split up. Like, it was just, yeah. Um, so, yeah, my dad I really didn't, you know. But now, you know, I realize, I find out, well, find out who my dad really is. And, you know, we have a relationship. Well, we talk or whatever, you know. I'm older now, so it's like. Yeah, and then my mom, as for my mother, we we have a relationship also. Um, she's a good grandmother to her kid, to my, well, to my child. She's the good grandmother, so, yeah. Um, uh, um, yeah, I went on to high school, and uh, I think I got pregnant around, what, 17, I want to say? I think I was pregnant at 17, but I was still in high school, and I still finished high school, of course, <clears throat> with no problems, and, um, yeah, he's here, you know what I'm saying, he's three, you know, it's three years ago, whatever, and yes, I am currently pregnant, um, 
I'm having another boy. As you say, my, because, you know, so I'm going to be having, I'm going to have two boys, whatever. Um, I'm going to do another video on that, but not right now. Um, uh, that's just, like, a little, a little story, a little summary of my life, of how it, and, you know, how I just came about and, this is how it was. My grandmother was there for me, like, every step, me and my sister, and um, supported us and everything, and shaped me into the person I am today. And, um, yeah, it was hard. There was problems, and, you know, it was, there were trials and tribulations, and we, we know we went through them together. Because at first we used to live, it was these apartments. I think they, they were here with stock apartments and we used to live there. And they were like low income apartments. Like we used to stay there. And it used to just be, you know, it was bad over there. It was horrible. The crime rates, it was just horrible. And I remember having to walk to school and my grandmother was like make sure you hurry up and go to school like run to school don't stop because the school was like it was like attached to the back of the apartment so you just go in through the gate and you know people were snatching people you know raping kids taking kids it was really it was just really bad at that time it was you know but we really stayed prayed up because i am a christian and i was raised you know, to believe, you know, you know, God, and it was just horrible at that time, well, you know, but for us, for us, not, no, now that I'm older, we, we didn't have no, we had a good, a great childhood, like, it wasn't bad for us, because we didn't, we had everything we needed, we had food, everything we got, Everything we asked for, we got. Everything we needed, we had. You know, Christmases, every holiday, Thanksgiving, everybody would come over to our place to Thanksgiving, Christmas, any holiday. You know, it was just any holiday. Family would come over. We had dinners. It was no different. We would go outside. We would go different places to the movies. To, and, you know, it was just for us. It was a great childhood. We had a great childhood. Um then we transitioned to like we moved a couple of times and um <clears throat> like like god really blessed us so we um moved to uh, it was I think it was another apartment it was a it was some more apartments i think they were um park at umble or something they think they were called parker uncle apartments and i think i was in intermediate school where i was fifth and sixth grade yeah and that was just we had to wear uniforms we had to wear uniforms elementary and all through elementary too but that was like and uh yeah and intermediate that's when i was intermediate and we moved we moved and um my intermediate school year it was good it was great like you know i was in a spanish comp no yeah i was went to a spanish competition i was really involved um in the elementary i was involved also i was a girl scout <laughs> Um, well, we used to have meetings and, um, I would go to different trips and things and go to different field trips. It was, it was cool. I was also on a step team. Like, I, my grandma, like, kept us, you know, where we can just do, you do things. It was, it was fun. And intermediate, I, um, I was in different things, different plays, different, uh, programs they had. It was, it was nice. Um, then I had, um, transitioned and I moved that same year i think i moved to my aunt house and i went to school over there i think that was fort ben yeah it was in a leaf no i mean it was in a leaf and um yeah i went to school for i think it was seventh and eighth i want to say yes i stayed out there for like what two years and um that time it was like you know <laughs> it was a horrible time at that time because like she <clears throat> I'm gonna just say the grass is not always green on the other side, but it was um it was a good and bad experience I want to say, but I when I had transitioned back over here and I was a freshman so I 
was already in high school the 9th 10th and i went to nimitz 9th 10th 11th and 12th and i transitioned back over here for high school my high school year was due to that bad experience it was <clears throat> it was okay i want to say i feel like it could have been better um i was kind of i wasn't bad but i just i don't know i did stuff like i got into fights and altercations and arguments and but i got my work done i wasn't a troublemaker but i just didn't let nobody like boss me around or tell me what to do type stuff you know like i wasn't not i had a ad like i had a bad attitude and a bad mouth and i still do my mouth is just but i'm working on that it has improved a lot because you know but i'm the type of person i was the type of student to always get my work done and then you know i was just that type of student to get my work done it's just if a teacher like disrespectful i feel like you're disrespectful or you came off disrespectful saying with a with a student or a kid and i'm feel like you're disrespectful i'm gonna say something and it was just like that and but i still graduated um i uh yeah i was pregnant with my son while i was in high school and it was kind of hard being a teen mom a teen parent or are you raising a kid why are you going to school you know you're raising a kid and you're going to school because mind you i had my son all the time and um yeah it was it was um it was an experience you know that's gonna be for another video i'm also gonna make a do another video but that it was a challenge but i still made it through so yeah i, I still made it through it was it was good um my son is a blessing to my life he actually made my life better i feel like um feel like he yeah he made he made my life better he slowed me down and i love him more than anything in the world and everybody knows that everybody he is spoiled oh my god he is so spoiled and he's a blessing like that oh my gosh it's amazing it really is he's amazing uh, he has got his own little personality and i'm happy to be his mother like i'm just so happy i'm blessed i'm just happy <laughs> um but that's a little just a piece of well not a piece that's just a summary basically of my life i mean of course more things have happened it's just that's just the basic basics i just wanted y'all to know a little bit about me um oh well i hope y'all you guys like this video um i really yeah i hope you guys like this video make sure y'all give my video a thumbs up make sure y'all share my video make sure y'all blow up my comment section or what content you want to see um and yeah <laughs> But make sure y'all, uh, oh, turn your post post notifications on so every time I post a YouTube video, then y'all get the notification. And yes, 